Dear Shai, my name is Okwigadogneti okay, Blessing. I'm here to thank God for what God did in my life. I went to service. Before I, before I came to church, I was crying because I have this eye problem that started in 2018. 2018, I had a dream, and in that dream, I went blind. So when I woke up, I told my mom about the dream. So we prayed, and that same 2018, or Christmas Day, I have a swelling on my eyes. And that's that. That was the genesis of all my problems. That's after Christmas and New Year celebration. On Monday of it, I went to the hospital, and the doctor said I had glaucoma. I was like, Jesus, what is that? The doctor said that it's a lifetime problem, that it does not have a cure. I was like, Jesus. So he gave me some drugs and eye drop. He said the eye drop is for a lifetime, and the drops for a lifetime. That all my life I'll be using it, unless only a miracle that can stop the pain and heal me so one of the the eye drops are here and since that 2018 to date i've been also using eye uh, eyeglass like only one of these eye drop is eight five and if i put the eye drop on my eyes i'll close my eye for 30 minutes i will not open my eyes for that 30 minutes i will not open my eyes so that the thing will be effective and this one has its own so this small one here is ten thousand naira. sometimes i'll borrow money to go and buy these drugs and there's this particular drugs i'm using the drugs is finished i don't even have money to go and buy it i was even crying because sometimes i'll go and borrow money to buy these drugs the only the drugs is fifteen thousand, and only this eye uh, eyeglass that I'm using, only this eye eyeglass is twenty five thousand. So on Wednesday service, I was not myself. I was crying. I was crying seriously because the eyes were paining me, and each time the eye pain comes, I will not do anything for that day. So Papa came to the altar, and Papa said, "There's somebody here." You have eye problem. God has healed you. And instantly the eye pain stopped. Like it stopped. No pain. No, nothing, nothing. I was not feeling any pain. And I can see clearly. Before I cannot even look light. But now I can look light. I can see. I can. In short, I am yet to see. Thank you, Jesus. And also, when I was growing up, I noticed that my mom have ulcer. She said the ulcer started when she was 15. And to date, uh, my mom has this children. I'm the last child of my mom. And when the pain comes, she will not she will not do anything that day. She will vomit just like that. So on um, Friday service, uh, in Monday service, my elder sister called me that my mom was hospitalized. So I told her that I have blood of Jesus at home, but I don't have TP to come to Bini. She said, okay, I should send my account details. I should send me transport. So she sent me the transportation and I went to Benin. I carried the blood of Jesus along. So when I got there, when I saw my mom, she was almost lifeless. So I was crying and I went to the doctor's office. The doctor said that the us have gone through the system that she it will only take a miracle for her to survive this pain. So I took the blood of Jesus. I gave her to drink and after she drank it, she slept for like three hours. When she woke up, this somebody that cannot even talk that cannot even do anything she stand up and she was okay so we told the doctor that she should run a test again the doctor run a test and that was the head so awesome children of god praise the